Hey guys, this is NDM here, welcoming you back to another episode of Let's Play Mother 3, right? So in the last episode, we was, uh, well, we left off on the Whack-A-Mole minigame, and in this episode, I guess we're gonna try and, uh, succeed in this. Bang, 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 bang! I thought your hammer was going to break. Here, let me see your eyes. Whoa, they're bloodshot, I'm afraid. Yeah, 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 yeah. Try again, but this time with a fresh outlook on things. Right, I do know what to do here. You're supposed to... Um, let him win, or let him win by one point. So I need to count here. So that, I don't know how many that was. <laughs> I was talking. Uh, um, but you need to basically let him win by one point on this. I think that I'll leave it there. So what you got to do is now just wander around and um, let him win by one point, I guess. Until well, you got to wander around until the game's finished, and then you can proceed on to the next four. Because otherwise you're not otherwise you're not suitable to see Master Pokey because you're a winner and he doesn't want you to win, but he wants he doesn't want you to lose either. He doesn't want you to suck. Oh right, I got seven. Damn it! See, he won't allow that. He won't allow seven. So you got allow you got allow the number to get to nine, and once you get nine, he'll be happy with it. So all right, so that's one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven. Oh, right, I just got that one. <laughs> Eight and nine. So now you just got we'll basically wait around and let the game finish. I'm hiding behind you. I'm hiding behind you. I'm gonna smack you around the head with this hammer so badly, then you'll all, then you'll be destroyed, and victory will be mine. Hmm. Time. So now uh, that should be nine points we've gotten from that, and uh, we should be able to proceed. Master Lucas's record: Ta-da! Total hits nine. Oh my, Master Mini Porky, you've won the intense match by the razor-thin margin of one mole. What a wonderful game! Truly heart-stopping. Now then, let's move on to the next fun and exciting game. So basically, you got to let him win by one point because he wants to be excited by it, so or make the match a little bit more tense. So then, yeah. Anyway, let's make a save there. I think that deserves a save, don't you think? So now we can go upstairs. Uh, I don't think by this point in the game we'll really be needing DP as such. <laughs> I don't know, I just... Well, just for the hell of it, I guess we could see how much we've gotten. There's no harm in seeing, I guess. Uh, yeah, let's see. Wait, I didn't even get to see! I <laughs> pressed the button too quickly. Hang on a second. Um, DP, yeah, we have plenty here, well, might as well take it all out, just in case there's like a final shop or something, or a shop inside the Empire Porky building that we can go ahead and buy some, uh, equipment. And what the hell, there's another one? Another mini game? Hmm, alright, things are looking, are really heating up now. Yeah, they definitely are, aren't they? What is this gonna be? What? There's water below us, and... I think it's water. Well, <laughs> what else would it be? Moving mountains? Because they got the, the kind of mountain structure. I don't know. <laughs> Next is the purple bridge race game. You'll both start from a purple bridge at the same time. And the first to reach the other side wins. You understand the rules, yes? Also, if you have the two wor words indulge the divulge, perhaps the former would be the one to focus on if you catch my drift. Do you understand? I certainly do, mister. Mr. Top Hat. <laughs> okay, when you're ready to go to go to your starting position. Uh, what does this person say? I don't know. This is written on the cue card. Your flies open X, Y, Z. Is that supposed to make any sense? You're much manlier now. What? <laughs> I don't understand. What the hell happened there? I don't know. Okay, so are we ready? Are we ready to get our game on? All right, on your mark, let's get set, go is when you start, okay? On your mark, let get set, go. Go, go, go. Um, can I run this or not? Well, I know what you're supposed to do here. You're supposed to wait on the, like, the last second. And then wait for him to cross. I don't know what happens if you fall off the edge. Whether that, whether you can, <laughs> uh, I wouldn't want to try that out for myself. But if only we could like use telekinetic abilities to make him um, fall off the edge. That'd be awesome. So that should be okay. Ugh, Master Lucas, 
What are you, a turtle, a turtoise, a turpane? You really should be more serious about this. I'm afraid I can't introduce you to Marky Master Porky if that's how you're going to act. What? I didn't I didn't win. You won. Okay, when you're ready to go. Oh, I must have, like, had one foot over the finish line before he did. Alright, on your mark, get set, go is when you start, okay? Alright, on your mark, get set, yeah, 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 yeah. Just hurry up. Get this uh, show on the road and stop messing around. <laughs> okay. I guess just wait about here then, like a few centimeters <laughs> off the edge. Don't go like right close to the finish line, otherwise you're gonna really mess it up. So make sure that he crosses the finish line first before you cross it, otherwise you're just not gonna do this, um, or not gonna be able to proceed onwards. So now that he's done, that should be fine. What? I? Are you serious? Oh God. I don't know how long this is going to take, but because <laughs> you obviously, you'll obviously, you'll obviously have to do it at like a certain specific time. I don't know. What the hell? I'm not even moving. And that's just supposed to like follow exactly the way he's going, and then you, you might have to be slightly behind him throughout the whole race. Oh my, Master Mini Porky, yeah, I did it. <laughs> you win the intense match by a nose. What a truly fantastic race. That was a match for the ages. Now then, let us let us move on to the third and final game. The third and final game. Alright, bring it on. I, got, I can take whatever you can dish out. Yeah, let's... Well, let's try f see if we can. Oh, no, you can't fall off the edge. It just seemed like you could. Uh, no, you can't fall off the edge. I imagine if you did, you'd probably end up dying anyway. <laughs> Hop, do you want? Do you need something? Yeah. Um, make another save here. Right, so let's go up to the final game then. Whatever this is going to be, we'll find out. So every ba basically every game you're supposed to win, or you're supposed to lose by like a second, and let him win. At last, we're at the final game. Please come this way if you would. Oh, it's like Mario Party, kind of. <laughs> the final game is, to whom goes the boom? Alright, here's a, here is a quick explanation of the rules. Yeah, give us the lowdown. Use your mental A button air pump to quickly inflate your balloon until boom! The first to pop his, his balloon wins. You understand the rules now, right? Certainly do. Then please go to your position. Was this going to be a Bowser pump that we have to press down? <laughs> now that I'm tippling the point tripling the points for this final game. This means you have a very good chance of coming from behind to win it all, Master Lucas. Please try your very best. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Ready, set, go. Okay, I'll try my best to lose. Okay, no, not not too much, not too much. Oh, this is going to be hard. I, I lost, I lost. Did I lose? Clap, clap, clap. You're so young, you have mastered so much. I hereby deem you fit to... Oh, I actually did do it. I thought I lost then. <laughs> okay. Now then, please go and pay Master Porky a wonderful visit. Uh, there's a blimp here and parachute, rocket rocket design on the floor and rainbows. Oh, there's a little... I like that little... Yeah, there's a little structure of Newport City. This is written on the cue card. Your flight isn't open. Don't worry about it. Yeah, it's a little structure of Newport City. Yeah, that's kind of nifty. Alright, so let's progress on. Oh, there's no save frog here. Darn it. Well, I guess they're not being so lenient this time. Uh, there's a sofa here. You can take a, take a nap on the sofa. Take a quick rest? Yes, I think I shall. Because uh, I don't know how much PP I have or anything like that, so I'm going to get a rest. Before we um, go up the stairs here. You've been fully revitalized. Okay. What the hell? Oh dear. Lucas, welcome to my room. This is the real 104 that you've wanted to come to oh so badly. Again, I welcome you to my beloved detestable pests. 
I was the one who invited you here, so you're free to come inside if you wish. It's just, I've given orders to let no one enter my room. To that little attack toy you see right there. Who knows, maybe this is where we'll say goodbye even though I invited you here. Alright, it's on. Alright, let's turn it on. Say hello to the natural killer cyborg. Uh, it looks like a giant mechanical pig. The NK cyborg suddenly attacked. Wow, that thing takes up most of the screen. <laughs> um... Oh god. Right, I guess we're gonna use basically our same tactics, I guess, that what we usually use. <laughs> so um what, what do we yeah, huh? Uh defense up on everyone and then Basically the first thing you wanna do uh, is just get his um offense down because his offense is probably going to be the one that yeah because he his offense determines on how much attack power he does against you so wow I did a four hit combo just then <laughs> decreased by 46 are you kidding me oh my god wow <laughs> that is so much um, defense we just took down on this thing bore down and attacked uh, that's not good <laughs> Um, right, uh, offense up, yeah, we we'll go offense up again, um, instead of defense up, and offense down, another, yeah. Whether we'll be strong enough to take this guy on, I don't know. <laughs> I'm digging this music, it's awesome. <laughs> do, 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 do. Or down and attacked, right? So I can see that his uh, attack is um, going down now quite a bit. Uh, right, uh, Lucas just uses um, offense up, so I'm gonna get Sharon healed here, and then she can use off uh, offense down again. Um, if because you can't usually use offense down more than three times on an enemy, so I don't know if this is gonna work again. I oh, know it does. His offense went down by 23. Pretty good. Fired several missiles. Okay. Uh, have to use another. Well, I'll use Life Up Amiga here, I think, and um, try this again. See if it does anything. Yeah, it, do it doesn't work. Right. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. counter device. Oh dear, right, this is where stuff is going to get kind of problematic, I think. Um, could you use a New Year's Eve bomb on this? Yeah, I'll try it. <laughs> and Shan can use... Uh, I don't think she should use a defense down, just in case. You know, because the counter could in decrease our defense, which is not what I want. Oh, uh, the New Year's Eve bomb doesn't work. Hmm. Right. I will. Uh, yeah, I think I will try and use defense down. Uh, I don't know if it will it counter it or what. Oh no, his counter shield's gone. Okay, I guess it only lasts for one round, which is good. Glad about that. <laughs> An electrical shock attack, right, so this is gonna obviously <laughs> hit the Franklin badge, which is... Well, no it didn't, it only hit the Franklin badge once. Damn it! Right, okay. <laughs> um, yeah, we'll di we'll dish out some damage here, I think. Get some damage going. And, uh... Star Storm. No, not Star Storm. Uh, defense down again. Get his defense down a bit more. And then after this round, I'll definitely use uh, another uh, Life Up Omega, because um, everyone needs a bit of healing here. Wow, 847 damage. Now this is where you want to be using manual attacks, because you don't want to get hit by the counter, of course. 
Wait, did I just use up? I I just used love, didn't I? I don't want to use love. What is life up here, Mega? And um, yeah, just go with manual attacks here for everyone else, because if a counter shield lasts one round, it's worth just using manual attacks just for that one round. So then you don't use spells and take damage from using the spells. Well, 36 damage. That's not too bad. <laughs> Uh, life, uh, love, yeah, he's another love here, and, um, another defense down. Because I think I only used that twice, didn't I? Pretty sure I did. Yeah, that should be the last time you could use it. Fire this end of century beam, whatever that does. Oh god, that's a scary looking phase, dude. <laughs> And it only does 181 damage, huh? I thought that'd be a bit more intimidating than that, but that wasn't actually too bad. I won't use another, um, I won't use another, uh, Love Omega, um, because Lucas is starting to run a bit low on the PP here. Hmm, no magic, uh, oh, magic cake, yeah, give that to Lucas. I think I should have used, um, <laughs> yeah, I should use Life Up Amiga here. Uh, on everyone, Sharon can go ahead and use another Star Storm. Mm, uh, Ness doesn't really have anything that he can do. I wonder if we can make this thing cry or something. That would be kind of funny if we could make a robot cry. King Burger, Ness. I guess. Might as well use that. At least no one's died yet, that's what I'm happy about. <laughs> mm, uh, no, I'm not going to use another life up because, you know, I need to use, um, be using more of that, uh, uh, life up Amiga instead of using love all the time. So we're gonna go ahead and I think probably go out with a ground attack. But I don't want to use it and then it doesn't do anything, you know. So I'm not gonna use another ground, I'm actually gonna use another Star Storm here, I think. Oh, it's dead, never mind. <laughs> that wasn't too bad, that was actually fairly easy. Even though we did waste a lot of PP on that guy. 34,381 experience. And we gained another level. Now level 66. So yeah, now the robot's been destroyed and we can hopefully now progress onto the next floor. If there, Can we go back down and get all healed up again? Because that's what I want to do. <laughs> uh, take a nap on the sofa. And I'll also get downstairs and make a save. Well, actually, I think I saw a frog right near that bench. I don't think I noticed that. No, I didn't notice that. Did that just appear? Because I wasn't there before, I swear. <laughs> yeah, we'll save. Um, please be careful out there. Give my regards to the next frog you meet. Right, I'm not sure if to end it. Well, what's beyond this door? I don't know. Well, this music. Hey, this is Mother One music. The int the introductions uh, music to Mother One. Uh, yeah, I will end off the video here. Um, so in the next episode of Let's Play Mother Three, we shall be going to the next floor of the Empire Porky Building. How many four four? How many floors are they are there going to be left of this dungeon? Holy crap! Anyway, guys, until then, this is NDM saying thanks for watching. Take care, everybody. See you in my next video, and goodbye.